Wapow! Welcome back to Let's Play Ghost of a Tale. I'm Burning Dog Face. And uh, last time I got my hands on the armory key and the last piece of the uh, the guard outfit. Yes, there it is. The Greaves. A pair of Greaves from a guard suit of armor. A pair of Greaves from a guard suit of armor intended to give protection to the lower extremities. Greaves have been an essential part of the Rat Guard's battle dress since the soldiers of the Ninth Garrison were literally brought to their knees during a disastrous encounter with the diminutive Shrew Knights of Threave. Many shins paid a heavy price for the Red Paw's arrogance that day. <laughs> the joke there, if you're not familiar with it, is that shrews are very, very small. I think they're smaller than mice. Mr. Big from Zootopia was an arctic shrew. You know, because he lived in the cold section of the city. Um... What am I doing? Yes! That's right, I stood on this nice sunny ledge because I thought this would be a good time to perform a test of this supposedly uh, OP outfit. Just... Here it is! No, that's not how you do that. Uh, fine, I'll just put them on manually. I'll just put them on manually. Oh, X, put on costume. Bam! Now you look like a scrawny rat recruit! I don't remember trying the helmet on before. He's still got a loot on his back. Oh, this is important. I, since I can't, uh... Since this is running and I can't sneak... I wanted to know what happens if I do this. Okay, I can still do that, which I figured, since you, you otherwise wouldn't be able to save. At least if this doesn't use up stamina, that would be very ridiculous. No wonder those guys do the slow, menacing walk. Sup? What can I do for you, soldier? Uh, I kind of didn't know that would work. That I could talk to you. I was issued a loot instead of a uh, sword. Uh, you know how I could fix that? You know, for a minstrel, he really isn't a very good actor. Always stuttering and nervous. Shit, Scow was the guy I was supposed to replace. I asked what happened to Private Scow, and uh, the question is evaded. I'm gonna guess that Silas wants me to go talk to the commander anyway, so I'm gonna go save, then talk to Silas and see what happens. I do know that this still won't help me do the thing. Honestly, it would probably be easier for me to just switch into a different outfit, knock him out with a bottle, burn both things, and run away. Soldier! Oh, never mind. I'll just keep going up, then. This is not the right turn. Uh, there we go. I got in a lot of trouble here once. You cannot jump like this. But you can climb a thing. Yeah, that's good to know. Huh. I can't climb up onto the table. 
This is silly. This is re goddamn ridiculous. There's a key on top of there. Yoink! Is this the war room? I don't see like a big map on the thing. Mind you, I don't see a chest either. So I don't know why I asked. Oh. Do I need sticks? No. Okay, so maybe it makes me really powerful and uh, the guards uh, don't care about me, but uh, let's face it, this is going to take forever if I wear this for the rest of the game. I'm guessing that was intentional. Okay, you know what? Uh, there we go. I'll just run. Now that I'm up high. Bottle of rot gut for some reason. That's oh, just rocks. I don't need that. Oh. Hmm. I was going to make a joke, but for the life of me, those clouds don't look like much at all. I mean, that one kind of looks like it's giving the thumbs up, but that's about it. You know, you know, like, just sort of stop and make a joke. Oh, that one looks like a pony or whatever. Up I go. Da, 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 da. Oh. Missed one. Scratch my nose. There we go. I wanted to get a good one, so, you know, health healthy sampling there. Uh, this is too far? Oh, that's right. It wasn't literally as high as you could go. It was, uh... Just next to that. Was it out here? Might have been. No, this is where I came from. God damn it, I just closed this door. Oh, well, then, where the fuck... Oh, there you are! Ha! That's funny. Yeah, when I was standing here, he was just behind this thing here. Oh, oh, oh. Parkour. Sorry. Uh, okay. I don't know if I just talked to him. Gotta be polite. Nothing on the ears slot, I note. Alright, there, mouse. How do I look? You look ridiculous, but it'll do. <laughs> I did I find it by accident. Tylo does seem to have a knack for saying what people want to hear. Which I guess is really uh, good for a performer. Come to think of it. Hmm. Rat presents you with a set of papers, folded and sealed with wax. Give this to the sentry. Rat flips a coin, you catch it, feeling its weight in your paw.
Oh, well, if he's fucking acknowledging it. I don't like the way he grinned as he said that. I'm going to post that one with just the caption, Word. Or possibly Mood. I did want to know how he, uh... knew it was going to be there, but, you know, say la vie. I guess I'll just steal all his books in compensation. Actually, before I do that, uh... Okay, quick save. God damn it. Yoink! The commander's orders! Deploying the rat guard to the lower keep. Oh, right, yeah, duh. Can't read that. Oh no, I can. Oh, I can load that game I just now saved. It is so ordered by the garrison commander at Dweenland Heights that first signal guard Silas Wagstaff descend into the lower keep to assess the severity of the arachnid infestation, lay traps, and place poisoned bait. Salary is paid at time and a half, doubling in the event of permanent injury and tripling for loss of limbs. In the event of death, all compensation shall be forfeit and used to offset funeral costs. Not anymore. In fact, just because I wouldn't put it past this game to be that clever, uh, this one. And I'm a guard again, so I'll just, uh, swing with my arms. Interesting. He defaults to the minstrel garb if it's a slot he doesn't have an item for. I wonder if they even modeled the back of his head. Probably not, if the only person who gets to see it is his wife. Up I go. No, no, no. Fine, I'll stick the goddamn apple cores. Didn't I not... Uh... I don't actually have that book. The log is written in a form of shorthand illegible to you. In that case... Pardon me, folks. Just bear with me. Ahem. <clears throat> but here's what really happened. Uh, no, uh... Okay, okay, yes, good, good. No, not the book. That's gonna be a quest item, that's what that is, I'm calling it. I will, however, steal your spy class. And your carrot. But you can leave have that one. I'm really just cleaning up after the guy with the apple cores. Oh, that was weird. God damn it. No, I don't want the apple. Oh. Oh no. I definitely can't uh, keep the game if I do that. Close peg. Will that help me walk through stink areas, or what? God damn it, me. Oh, why do I have to be the good guy all the time? Okay, first things first. Hey, I've stolen your spyglass, just FYI. Uh, okay, he doesn't give a shit about that. Awesome! Let me try that again. You can't run uh, up here, by the way. I mean, obviously, but I have seen games where you hold down the run button and your guy climbs faster. Secrets of a signal guard. 
Oh, that just starts a quest. So we don't have the spyglass. The lens of the spyglass's eyepiece is cracked. Fuck. Silver coins adorned with ornate symbols. They appear to form part of a phrase of the language is unfamiliar to you. Can't just look at it. So this is figurines. The mouse is figurines found at the signal guard's footlocker. Two Lutkas, one of a buck, the other a doe, found in the possession of a rat. Strange, no mouse would ever give up their figurines willingly. How come this didn't change to, you know, Tylo's figurines? Put a shirt on, you naked fuck. I should probably take the clothes bag, huh? It just seems like something that'll come in handy later. A wooden clothes bag. Are you kidding me? It makes me heavily resistant to poison. And fire? <laughs> That's silly. Wait, that just, it just caught on to my brain that that's garlic hanging from the wall. Is he afraid of vampires or something? Take the ridiculous hat off. You went through my possessions? feel bad. Um... I'm just sitting here... Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm just sitting here legitimately wondering, oh, should I have done that? Or maybe it'll leave the conversation options. It'll lead to conversations in the future, you know? Like maybe when I get back, I can ask him about his apparent secret wife and kid. Oh! Wait a minute, if it's night time, yes. Then there's a thing I can do. Okay, that's better. Except I only thought I knew where I was. Yes, now I know. Okay, good. Good. And jump. It's too late. I've vanished. You can't help it. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Ghost of a Tale when we help Fatal get to sleep again. Later!